Peter's and Money Talk here with another video. I was going to put this in a YouTube short, but now I'm like, you know, I'll just do a regular video. So, and this is with Uber Eats. So, I'm going to talk about what orders I accept and what orders I don't accept. I'll tell you what order I'm not taking. I'm not taking this Fleming Island order that's it. That's, it's a mellow mushroom order in Fleming Island. And they want me to go to like St. Augustine. And guess how, it's like 34, about 34 miles. And guess how much he's going to pay me? $12. So I am not taking that. <laughs> so what type of orders do I take? Well, I'll try to take orders that are like a dollar per mile. That's what I tried. I mean, Two dollars per mile, that'll, that'll be like really good, but let's be honest, you're probably gonna be waiting around for a while to get a mile, like to get a uh, order like two dollars per mile. Maybe one of these days I'll set up my apparel app to two dollars per mile just to see how much I get. May, may I'll talk about that in a future video. But I normally try to take a app, take orders out like a dollar per mile. I usually want to take orders out less than a dollar per Per mile, unless it's t unless it's going to a direction I'm going to, like my friend lives in Argyle, and I live like in Green Coast. Let's say I also go to my friend's house. I had a Uber Eats app on, and there was like a offer, Mella Mushroom. We're gonna use it, Mella Mushroom again, Mella Mushroom to Argyle and. The miles, we're gonna say the miles is kind of long. It was like 15 miles for eight dollars. Normally, I wouldn't take that, but since it's heading towards my friend house anyway, I mean, I might as well get some money out of it. <laughs> so that's and another time I you I'll take a order that's like under a dollar per mile is if I'm just ready to go home. Sometimes I'm just ready to go home. If I'm just ready to call a day and I get an offer, it's like three dollars. Yeah, three dollars for seven miles. Because normally I don't take that, but we're gonna say I got one that that was that that cheap, and it was take me towards my home. I mean, I may take it. I'll probably take it. I usually try to take orders that are like over four dollars at least. So. Let's say it was like five dollars, and the miles is like seven miles. I'll even I'll even make it eight miles. The tow drive was eight miles, but it was going towards my area, Green Cove. I mean, I'll I'll take an order like that, cause once I drop that order off, I get to go home. I like I like it even better when the place I'm going to is my apartment complex because I live in these apartment complexes in Green Cove. So sometimes I will get offers that are like at my apartment complex. I've never got one that's like my exact building number. But I got some that were like pretty close. I think I had one that was like two buildings away from my building. So when I get work like that, I am happy. Especially when I'm ready to go home. But I'll tell you what I'm not gonna do. I'm not gonna drive to from here to St. Austin for less than a dollar per mile. I, I am not doing that. I wonder how long that twelve dollar I think it was like twelve dollars and thirty-four cents they was to pay for somebody to drive. 34 miles to say long thing. <laughs> I mean, I am not taking that. Last year, I think it was about a year ago, maybe a little less than a year ago, I was in Orange Park. I know, or was it from? Yeah, it was Fleming Island. It was like right for Orange Park. Y'all probably don't know what these cities are.
and I had this. I think it was. I think the the total trip was like 20 miles. It was. It was around 20, 22. I don't remember the exact. Normally, I don't, I don't take offers that long. But here's the thing: they charged me. They were they were paying me like thirty four dollars. I think it was. So like you know what? I'm gonna take this. It was a good order. Thirty four dollars. That's pretty good. It, it it does fit over the one dollar per mile, so I definitely did take that. I did have to drive across the bridge, across the two ninety five bridge. Then I had to drive back across the two ninety five bridge, go to Argyle, and I delivered their order. But I did tell her I usually don't take orders that long, and she's like, "Yeah, that's why I added tip." <laughs> So I guess she knew the deal. So if if it's at least a dollar per mile, I'll usually take it. Sometimes I just don't feel like driving it's been a long time. So I, there could be reasons I I just don't accept orders, or sometimes take to, me to an area I just don't want to go to. So those could be reasons I just don't accept certain orders or offers. Sometimes I just don't like the restaurant. That could be a reason. If it's like certain restaurants, sometimes I just don't go there. Like, what was that restaurant on? It's in Orange Park. I mean, sometimes not too bad, but a lot of times it can be really crowded. So, and I'll end up canceling it just because how crowded it is. I just can't think of the name of the place. It's a, they serve breakfast. Is it Metro Diner? Yeah, I think that's what it is. They serve breakfast. It's a lot of times it be crowded. They don't have my order ready. I'm going. <laughs> that's how it is sometimes. Sometimes I just don't feel like waiting around. And I don't really like crowds like that. Maybe some of y'all don't mind crowds, but I really don't like crowds like that. And what else? Walmart orders or offers. It, they can be tempting sometimes. Sometimes, one thing I don't like about some of these Walmart orders offers that they give you. They're like a certain time you can like accept it. They want to tell you, they, they will not tell you the total miles. So you press itself, you don't even know if it's fitting in that dollar per mile. If you go to self it and you'd be driving like 20 miles and only get paid like $7. <laughs> Sometime, cause they just want to tell you. It's like when they have like these scheduled pickups. In the Uber Eats app, you go to like opportunities. There'll be like some Walmart offers in there. But of course you get those regular Walmart offers that just pop up. Just like regular Uber Eats orders. They'll pop up sometime. Some of those Walmart offers, they be garbage. Four dollars for like what? Fifteen miles. <laughs> sometimes that'll be garbage. Other times that'll be good. Like sometimes these Walmart offers. They'll be like my best offer sometime. I did have one offer that was like, what, $30? I think it was like around, it was like between four miles to six miles. I'm like, I'm, I'm clicking on that. I'm taking that offer. But guess what happened? I click on it and it said the uh, offer was no longer available. It, it went to another driver. <laughs> so sometimes that does happen. I guess they, they saw it too and they click on it. <laughs> a lot of time a lot of times you will know how much you at least you're supposed to know how I mean how much you're getting for the Walmart orders. Sometimes they'll be wrong. Like I had this Walmart offer. It was seven dollars and it did fit into one dollar per mile, so I took it. I figured it was just gonna be like a few items. I was just gonna like put in my passenger seat and I was just gonna drive 
to their place and just drop it off. But guess what? It filled up my whole car and my whole trunk. I drove to the house. And I had to go back and forth to my car quite a bit. I was hoping they would give me like some extra, like an extra tip, but I did not get no extra tip. And that was frustrating. I wish I would have just canceled that order. Like as soon as I saw those groceries, I wish I would have just ran away. Because I'm not taking that anymore. From now on, if I see an offer like that, I'm just not going to take it anymore. I wouldn't mind doing an offer like that. If they pay me at least $10 at the minimum. I think that that should be at least a $10 job at the minimum. That's how I feel. If I'm going to get a big offer like that, they better pay me more than $7. <laughs> it filled up my whole trunk. And I had to go back and forth. But some of these Walmart people, they will give you like an extra tip. And I use Walmart Smart myself sometimes. As a customer, not a driver. One of these customers, one of these drivers, they missed out because I had like a $10 cash tip I was going to give them. They went to my door. They dropped the groceries off and they, and they left. So they didn't get my $10 tip. And I don't think I was able to tip them inside the app. I'm not sure why. I'm not sure why they why they didn't knock on the door. Maybe I had set, maybe it was set to leave that door or something. And I just forgot to change it. <laughs> Who knows? But that is it. So, if there's any, what type of Walmart, what type of Uri's orders you accept and what type you want to sell? Another thing I do accept sometimes is the pay, pay order. Is it pay, order and pay? Sometimes I accept those. I don't really like doing them because I would always be worried I'm not, I'd be, I'm not going to find certain items and they're going to reduce my chill. I'd be worried about that sometimes. But those times I'm desperate, I would take it. I honestly don't know how long I'm gonna do Uber Eats. I did Uber Eats basically for YouTube content for some extra income because I was trying to I was trying to like put some money to the side for a down payment on, on the home and to bring some of the credit down. I was quite sure how much I was gonna make with Uber Eats. I was just testing it. But honestly, I'm not sure how long I'm gonna sit to it. I mean, it's just a side. It's just basically a side hustle because I do have a main job. And of course, I did. I also do DoorDash too sometimes. Not as much as Uber Eats. I made less than six hundred dollars with DoorDash, which I kind of wanted that way. That way, I don't have to give them like a tax form. Because <laughs> the tax place I go to, they charge. I think they charge like. That's just for every task form they get. So that's one reason I try to keep DoorDash under $600 per year. But anyway, have a good weekend. Bye for now.